go. Hey, I'm Jay Bird Wells. I'm here with KJAG Radio, KJAG TV, and we just got done with the MWE match in Hutchinson, Kansas. And right here I have a cowboy. It's me. It's me, Jay Sanchez, a honky tonk kid, and I was asked to do this, and I don't really know what we're supposed to talk about. Um, so enlighten me, carry me through this. For I can enlighten you. What? Can you enlighten me about tonight's match? About my match? Yes. Okay, well my match, hmm. I had a lot of fun, the people were into it, you know, they eat it up and they love it so much, you know, and it's fun to see that there's people out there just like me, I grew up a fan of this, and they just, you know, want to be a part of it, and now I'm actually the one who was a part of it, and now I get to do it, and do it in front of people, chant my name, it's a very surreal experience, even though it's on a smaller scale, one day it'll be on a bigger scale, but until then we're just going to keep on rocking and rolling down this road. Has the dream come true for you? Well, not yet. This is just a piece to the puzzle that we're putting together in hopes that we make it up to the, the big leagues. Um, there was a song playing when you came out. What was yes. it? Uh, that is a song that is called Freight Train by Eric Lonson. Uh, he's a Texas Red Dirt. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I cutting in on this? Yes, you're you are cutting I greatly yes. apologize. I'm sorry. Luckily, I wasn't walking around. That was here. Angel. Busted up. So, Midwest Entertainment, right? Yeah, Midwest Entertainment. <laughs> Alright, so back to you. So they kind of stole the show tonight yeah, yeah, with they, the three match. The triple threat? Yeah. I didn't catch it. I was back here handling some business and taking care of my own, my own Injuries? Here. Did you get injuries? Yeah, they banged up my leg a little bit. I banged up my left leg a little bit, but we're working out the kinks and it's feeling feeling alright now. Feeling alright? So, what was your favorite move that you did? My favorite move that I did, it would have to be the spear. What's the spear? Well, the spear is just uh, throwing myself into his gut with my shoulder and in hopes that I get him down for the one, two, three. So, every time I ask these, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to be the example of how to do that. No, that right. sounds too painful. Yeah, it takes a tough person to do it. Not for everybody. No. Not for everybody. So for the people that would want to do it, what would you suggest them to do? What I suggest them to do, I would suggest you finding a good school. I was trained by WWE superstar Seth Rollins at the Black and Brave Wrestling Academy. Shout out to them. I, uh, they trained for them. I trained not for them. I trained with them uh, for roughly three months in 2015. And literally it's the best training, you know, physical conditioning that you're going to get out there. So it's worth your, you know, it's worth your money. So that's what I said. Black and Brave Wrestling Academy, they're out there. I think it's blackandbravewrestling.com. They're on Instagram and Twitter and give them a holler. Don't tell them I sent you because they might push you away. <laughs> I don't know. You never know. <laughs> now, how do we get a hold of you on yes. social media? How do we find you on, on uh, Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram? Oh, okay. Well, I'm on Twitter and Instagram. It's jsanchez underscore 32. And you can see all my bumps and bruises from being in the ring and promo pictures and all that good stuff. Just bits and pieces of my life. So, what you eat for breakfast? <laughs> uh, well, I don't go that far. Uh, no, 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 I don't go that far. But now you get to see a lot of my injury stuff. Selfies in the gym. All right. So <laughs> to wrap up tonight. So should people go and see MWE in the future? Most definitely. Most definitely. Especially if I'm here on the card. And I like to think of myself as a big time player wherever I go. And you want to see Jay Sanchez wherever he is around town because. Because yeah. uh, oh, I'm going to be kicking ass and taking names. That's cliche, I know, but you hear it time and time again, but you can believe it when it comes from me because it's real. Be there. <laughs>